Please watch this. These Ghanaian kids want TikTok, but Kendrick Lamar won at life because he experienced unity and the community. So I found six things about Ghana that separates Ghana from the rest of the world. And the first of these six things is their unity and their community. Ghanaians do not play about being united. They do not play about being together. They do not play about the neighborhood, okay? But first, a quick story time. I have a friend who's white American. He converted to Islam. So his name used to be Stephen. He changed his name to Suleiman. And I asked him one day, what's your dream? He said, my dream is to move to Ghana and marry an African queen. Now, mind you, my Caucasian friend, he's six foot seven. Just converted to Islam. Now he's Suleiman, okay? And he said, I want to move to Ghana and I want to marry a Ghanaian queen. And he did that. And he told me when he came back to America, he said, man, the way that they welcomed me, the way that they made me feel like I was a part of them since I was a kid, it told me everything about these people. He said, I love Ghanaian people so much. So the first thing about Ghanaian people is their community aspect. The second thing about Ghanaian people is that they are hospitable. If you go to Ghana and you get lost or you're hungry, it won't take very long before you find somebody and they invite you to their house to stay at their house and to eat with them. You will never be homeless or hungry in Ghana especially if you are traveling from abroad. The third thing about Ghanaian people, they are big on respect, so they are so freaking polite. You will feel like these people are your family. You will feel like these people have been knowing you since you were in diapers. That's how polite they are, but don't cross their lines, okay? Don't cross the lines of a Ghanaian people because everybody that's nice to you has a side that you don't want to see. The fourth thing about Ghanaian people is that they're so friendly. You will always see them smiling. You could go to Ghana and you gonna have a conversation with some strangers. I know in some parts of the USA, nobody about to have a conversation with you. They gonna be like, what you need from me? They not about to sit and talk to you. If you go to Ghana, all right, you gonna have the whole village coming to see you, coming to greet you. You gonna feel what it feels like to be a president, a diplomat, an ambassador when you come to Ghana, when you go to Ghana. And you could be like a regular dude. Hey, it's me, Steve from Ohio. What? Bring the village. They so freaking friendly. The fifth thing about Ghanaian people is that they very faithful and a country that stands on principles of faith, whether you be Muslim, whether you be Christian, whether you be Jewish, is a country that's gonna stand. Here in America, we're not standing on faith. That's why the country is falling apart. We're standing on uh, uh, pronouns and colors, okay? It's not long. I don't know what's going on in the United States, but we ain't standing on faith in the United States, unfortunately. But in Ghana, they stand on faith. They are a people of faith, and they live their lives, and they run their communities by faith and respect. And the sixth thing about Ghanaian people is that they're going to give you good babies. I'm telling you, my boy Suleiman, he went over there. Before he left, he had no kids. He came back, I think he got like four or five of them. You want good babies? You want good good builds? You want babies that's going to be smart, faithful, polite, friendly, nice, tough warriors? Go to Ghana and get you uh, a good wife. I, don't, I know people don't like the passport bros, but passport bros, y'all keep doing what y'all do. Maybe y'all should start looking at in Ghana if you want a good woman that's going to give you good babies and treat you good. All right, because I ain't never heard my boy Suleiman complain. But yeah, shout out to the people of Ghana. Much love to y'all. <laughs>
Yes, they say good name is better than rushes. Yes, like the way Ghanaians are projecting that good name out there. And uh, now you can see how the the travel out there and they are doing that gyrations and they are making themselves happy, making the country proud, putting the image, the name of the country in the map. Because right now they they are always proud about their self wherever they meet wherever Ghanaians meet around abroad in Europe when Ghanaians they meet they are always proud of their self they are not just like our neighbor my fellow brothers so they are not like them wherever Ghanaians meet they always try to be proud of their country you see what they are doing there like this kind of video is to make some people to learn. Yes, to make some people to learn. That is what this kind of video is all for. That's it. When you watch this video, you will learn some second things. Learn, learn, you should learn. Don't be only our government is not doing well. Even Ghanaian government is not doing well. But the citizens of Ghanaians are trying making it look like everything is okay wherever they meet. Because if the government is not doing well, you also the, the government cannot take happiness away from you. That's what Ghanaians are doing. Ghanaians try to make it understand that government, you cannot do it well, but the happiness, you can't take it away from us. Wherever we met, we must unite and happy together, making people to understand we are Ghanaians. That is what Ghanaians are doing, and it's so lovely. What's the rest video? I say, what's up, like, everybody could do in your mind, I say, they break up the club, that's not what you're such as. Now, I want you to buy him. This is how they. It's a magana I am doing it three times a day. We meet up on once. We have fun check. We have mighty good beer. But we are no more than concrete too. We are not sure who we are. We are not doing so now. Then we are doing fair too. We are doing so. We are doing so one for the bar. Why? Why? We are doing so one for the bar. Hey, they were too. Hey, Joe. Where style? Where I I Yeah, i <laughs> Atasibia. The reason you need to be proud of Ghanaians, a Ghanaian born white. We come back to Ghana. Come and stay. <laughs> but I remember in those days in Nigeria, it's difficult for Nigerian born white to return back to Nigeria. Hmm, I'm hitting points. But in Ghanaian born white, they return back to Ghana. And they don't want to even return back from Ghana to the to abroad. They will stay in Ghana forever. But what happened? I remember in those days, a Nigerian, all those Nigerian rich men who born Pekin, they are Pekin now white. Today we cannot find them all. That's why I'm talking it slow, slow, so that people will know here, so that people will know come and fight me. Now, what? 
No, 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 no. I need to I talk this thing. Ghanaian born white, they, they return back home. But what happened to Nigerian born white? They know they like return home. Even the part their father will die, they will never come back to Nigeria. They will never come home. In those days, sure, we well, need to talk this thing, sure. Although some people, they don't hear it now. They go, people will go and talk about this. Uh, but I don't bring awareness. I don't create awareness now. But I will really talk about it. Let's move on. I see. 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 I you to Brazil and you to Jamaica and you to Cuba and you have to go on so on. Oh, no answer, man. Yes, I'm saying, my brother, you have to iPhone 15, iPhone 20, and you have to go back to the house. I'm going to go back to the house. Yes, I want to break a cry. I want to break a cry. Oh, no, 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 I want you to tell me, baby. I say, 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 I I say, I say, I Eh, no, yeah, well, I want when you have to tell my hands, you ain't fine boy, I got that. Yeah, fine boy, I kind of what the press on me, I'm a guy, yeah, boy, but I'm by force. Young boy, no, baby, I'm a good thing, I look for go. President Tom, I'm a good thing, I look for go. This is a man, I'm a good baby, I like. Me too, I'm a good one, 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 I'm down here, bury the law, cast say or be two me out of your bachelor. Go in my ordeal of bachelor. There are four a bachelor. I'm a rough fool, Babriella, go yes, see more women. Yame, yes, she like, yes, she you, Mr. Chevania, Mr. Chevau, yame, yes, she like, yes, you. All right, thank you everybody. My name is Master Manager and Jan News and KCT. If you want to reach out to me, look at my bio, my WhatsApp number is there. What do you have to discuss with me? I'm there for you. <laughs> look at my bio, my WhatsApp number is there, as I said. Do you have anything to share with me? <laughs> Yes, thank you. And I just want to say, see me in my next video. And bye-bye for now. Enjoy your day.